Hi, Oakview. Miss Williquette here, and I just want to share with you a few resources when you're looking for books to read. Um, I have a quick apology. We might have to toggle between a few different uh, tabs, but I'm going to show you some places where you can find resources. So the first thing, I little caveat here, I think we need to be logged out because my resources list don't show up under yours. That's the first thing I'm going to show you is resource list. Um, I think if you have your own resource list, you'll see them, but we'll have you go ahead and just log out for just a moment. And you'd probably have to toggle back in and forth, back and forth if you want to put a book on hold. But if you'd go to your catalog here and you go to resource lists, I have a ton of different um, genres that you can look up and you can see what uh, books that we have within that genre. So you might look at like, maybe you really love those book and verse. So you would view this one and then all of the books, we have three pages worth of books in verse. Again, apologies that you might have to toggle back and forth because then you have to log back in to put one of these on hold. But we have a lot of different resources that you can peek at. The other thing I wanted to share with you, and hopefully we can find things that we have in our library. If not, we can always put things on request too. But another place I like to go when I'm looking, if you go to your homepage here, down here we have Epic Reads, Penguin Reads, Goodreads. I like these to give me some ideas and I actually look at these when I'm ordering books. But if you'd go to Epic Reads, they tend to have a little more, um, a little longer descriptions of books. And so you can, these are some top trending ones and you have to toggle back and forth. But if there's something on here that you were looking at, apologies. You really liked it and you found in ours that we didn't have it. One thing that you can do is you can request that book and then I'll do what I can to get it uh, into our, our library. So those are a couple places you can look. One more place I wanted to share just very quickly with you is if you go within oops, our catalog and we're in our library search, we also have the top 10. This is just our more popular ones. You might look on that and say, wow, I've already read these. We obviously, the number one thing we have checked out in our school is the Chromebooks, but the new kids had the highest circulation so far. Scythe, if you haven't read it, I highly recommend it. And so these are some of the top ones that you see too. Hopefully that gives you some ideas. Happy reading.